A three-story building is still under construction on Akombe Crescent in the Yaba area of Lagos State has collapsed. There are possible casualties stuck in the building. The building collapsed into another building beside it. According to an eyewitness, a part of the building had collapsed late last year, but the construction did not stop. So far, only a 16-year-old boy and another adult male have come out of the rubble, while there is an unconfirmed number still trapped in the collapsed building. We're now being joined on the prime time news by the DG CEO, Lagos State Emergency Management Agency, that's Dr. Olufemeke Osoi Tolu. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you for joining us on the news. Yes. Uh, this is another sad incident. Uh, uh, I mean, uh, we're just trying to get out of the 21-story building and then another two-story building. And yet, this one, what's going on in Lagos? Well, rescue right now, rescue operation is ongoing. The Commission of Physical Planning is on the ground. The Commission of Special Duty is on the ground. All the key first responders are on the ground. And the rescue operation, search and rescue operation is ongoing. However, after we have completed the whole um, search and rescue, we will carry out holistic investigation. Then we'll be able to answer all these questions. Doctor, doctor, um, uh, thank you for that um uh, update, but then my concern, my, my very first question was uh, the the uh, the spate of building collapse in Lagos. I mean, are you bothered at all? Your concern is different from my own concern. My own concern now is I can rescue and operation is ongoing. After we might have finished the job, we will come to look at it politically, and we will be able to do the needful. Okay, um, it's also commendable that your men are already on the ground to, to yeah, search well, and rescue as many as possible. I'm, I'm right there. I told you earlier that the, the top echelon, the ESCO members, the Honorable Commissioner of Social Planning, Honorable Commissioner of Social Duties are on the ground with all other key stakeholders. And search and rescue are ongoing. We are using sophisticated equipment, light and heavy duty equipment. And by the grace of God, we will get to the Grand, grand Zero very soon. Okay, by the grace of God. Okay. Now, um, a part of the building collapsed last year, but uh, construction did not stop. Uh, what an effrontery. Why would uh, builders do this to, to citizens? So, what, are you looking into this at all, or what happened? Can you also bring us we up to speed? look at it, politically, after we might have completed the start and rescue operation, right now, all our mind, all our effort, all our adrenaline is on how to save life. So, we will look into it, we will look into it integrity. Then, we will be able to do the needful. Okay, now, um, your job is to rescue people. You search and then rescue. Um, My job is to conduct holistic search and rescue. Okay, and very... And after that, we will look all the issues that come up. Okay, so uh, what about... Um, what about the, the, the workers, other workers? Uh, what about, did any other, how many people sustain injuries? Because what we have now at the moment is that a 16-year-old boy and another adult male have come out of the, of the rubble. So what has have you found so far? Well, we have able to save two people from the rubble and um, they, receive, they receive adequate treatment the operation is still ongoing. So, uh, what should we expect tomorrow? What actions, what other actions will we be taking tomorrow? We will give you the update. Okay. Will your men be working there all night? Definitely. We put all our lights there. 
fire services are there, the ambulance services are there, our heavy duty equipment are there, which our light duty equipment and police. Thank you very much for joining us on our Prime Time News. Um, hopefully, uh, we'll reach you again tomorrow. Uh, we, Thank we, you very much. We pray you'll be able to, uh, we have time for, to, for us tomorrow again. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. We wish you the best in your search and rescue efforts. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.